Hi guys and welcome to Simply Hike. Today I'm going to be talking to you about the Mammut Heron Crest 40 litre rucksack. Let's take a look shall we? So as you can see from the general design on the front part it looks like any other rucksack. You do have um, entries from the bottom as well as on the top like you get with a standard rucksack and then the waterproof cover is located at the bottom. Obviously you've got compression straps on the bottom, the top as well as the side so you can adjust it accordingly and you do have some pockets on the side there as well. So let me unclip the front part and I'll show you the front pocket. Now it's best to actually get it down like that. So the front pocket itself, as you can see, has a nice stretch material. So it's really gonna be really handy if you, you know, putting your jacket in there, your GPS system, even depending on, you know, your helmet size, you might even be able to get a bike helmet stretch in there as well. On the top part, yet again, to go with the adjusters, you've got compression cord in the middle as well as on the top part of the rucksack. So as I say, you can adjust it accordingly. So let's open her up and take a look at the inside. So yet again, the inside has a standard base to it. What you'll notice as well is the actual middle part is zipped up at the moment. So what that means is you can have two compartments. So you can have the top pit and the bottom pit separate. You can undo that bottom, you know, the bottom compartment, and then you can have it going all the way through the rucksack. So as I say, adjustment, adjustment, adjustment. Obviously, as well as on the inside, you do have the, um, the you know, the bladder section as well. I'll show you that in a second where that comes out. Um, Right, next thing to show you is the, if I just even clip that, we have the safety pocket on the top there. You get a nice mesh material. Yet again, nice and spacious for your wallet, your mobile, for any other, any other bits and bobs like that. Now you may have noticed this strap system that I unclipped here to show you. Now what you can do is unclip on that and then you can use this as a waist pocket. So if you're doing a bit of trail running and you're doing a bit of wild camping as well, and you just want, you know, you want to go off on the trails but leave your rucksack, you can use this as an additional storage area. You know, you can attach it to your hips and away you go. And obviously that works with the traditional pocket that you normally get as well. So you can use obviously the safety pocket and this top pocket here to store, you know, any other bits of bobs that you want to take with you. As I say, that's a really nice feature. What you can also do is adjust it accordingly as well so even if you don't want to take the top part off you can raise the hood of the jacket itself or should i say not jacket it's because i said hood the actual rucksack itself so let's take a look at the back obviously that's where the bladder hose comes out and obviously attaches through onto the strappings on there now as standard you've got your nice adjustable chest straps grab that one as well as the click nice and easy like that and pretty much with any mammu rucksack that you get you get your safety whistle as well. So let's take a look at the hip strap itself. Yet again, it's a nice buckle system, easy to undo and obviously to clip up. And then you've got the adjusters on the side there. You do also have a nice side pocket as well. And again, nice and wide for a mobile phone, your GPS, or if you've got a bit of, you know, Kendall mint cake or anything like that, you want to just keep handy so you can nibble on as you walk. Now the nice real key feature really with this rucksack is the mesh panelling along the back here. So it's going to be great for ventilation, but also means it's going to be nice and soft on your back. And also it ties in with the actual adjustment of the back panel. So really using this Velcro, well, as you can see, it's super strong. You can actually raise and lower the straps accordingly, push them back on that. And then there you go, it won't budge. Now yet again, the Velcro itself works on the pressure of your back. So once it's on the back and obviously once your bag's full, it won't budge and it won't move. There we have it. This is a great rucksack from Mammut. And for any more information, please visit us at simplyhike.co.uk.